Imagine your belly as a hidden vault storing away every late night snack and midnight craving. Now imagine what would happen if you simply stopped feeding that vault after the sun goes down. For 14 days straight, no food passes your lips once darkness falls. It sounds almost too simple to be revolutionary, yet beneath your skin, something extraordinary may begin to unfold. Your body operates on an ancient clock, one that has been ticking for thousands of years. This internal timekeeper doesn't care about your Netflix binges or your late dinner plans. It follows the sun, the moon, and the natural rhythm of day and night. When you align your eating with this primal schedule, you're not just skipping evening snacks. You're essentially experimenting with a pattern that some people find helpful for their metabolism. Most people think belly fat is just about calories in versus calories out. But the truth runs much deeper. The timing of when you eat those calories can completely influence how your body handles them. Your metabolism isn't a static furnace burning fuel at the same rate all day long. It's more like a sophisticated orchestra with different instruments playing at different volumes depending on the time of day. Within hours of stopping your evening eating, your insulin levels begin to shift. Insulin, the hormone responsible for storing energy, naturally decreases when you're not feeding your body. This drop isn't just a minor adjustment. It's a biological signal that tells your fat cells to stop holding onto their reserves so tightly. The stubborn belly fat that has been clinging to your midsection suddenly becomes more accessible as fuel, at least for many people following structured fasting patterns. But here's where it gets fascinating. Your body doesn't just burn any fat randomly. During those first few nights without evening meals, your system may begin prioritizing certain fat stores, including the fat that wraps around your abdominal organs. This visceral fat, often discussed in health research, can be more metabolically active, which is why some studies suggest it responds earlier to changes in eating patterns. The magic really begins around day three. By this point, your circadian rhythm starts to reset itself. Your cortisol levels, which naturally peak in the morning, become better synchronized with your eating patterns. Instead of spiking erratically from late night eating, your stress hormones follow their intended schedule. This alignment creates a metabolic environment where fat burning becomes more efficient for many individuals. Your liver, working quietly in the background, transforms into a fat burning powerhouse. Without the constant influx of evening calories, it shifts from storage mode to breakdown mode. The glycogen reserves that have been sitting idle begin to deplete, forcing your body to tap into fat stores for energy. It's like finally accessing a savings account you forgot you had. Sleep quality can improve during this period. Without food sitting heavy in your stomach, your body can focus on the repair work that happens during deep sleep. Growth hormone, which naturally surges at night, can do its job more effectively. This hormone doesn't just help with muscle recovery, it supports natural metabolic processes related to energy use. By day seven, something remarkable happens. Your appetite begins to regulate itself naturally. The evening cravings that once felt overwhelming start to fade. Your body learns to expect fuel during daylight hours and rest during darkness. This isn't willpower anymore, it's biology working in your favor. The transformation isn't just physical. Many people report mental clarity that seems to emerge from nowhere. Without the blood sugar swings that can come from late night eating, your brain operates on a steadier fuel supply. Focus sharpens, energy stabilizes, and decision making improves. It's as if lifting the burden from your belly also lifts a fog from your mind. Research from the University of Alabama revealed something extraordinary about earlier eating patterns. Participants who stopped eating in the early evening showed improvements in insulin sensitivity that went far beyond simple weight loss. Their bodies became more efficient at processing nutrients and responding to hormonal signals. The changes accelerate as you approach the two-week mark. Fat oxidation the process of breaking down stored fat for energy may increase as your metabolism learns to anticipate the fasting period and prepare by becoming more effective at accessing fat stores. What started as a simple scheduling change becomes a complete metabolic shift for many people. Your digestive system also gets a chance to rest and repair. The constant work of processing evening meals gives way to a period of restoration. Inflammation may decrease, gut health may improve, and nutrient absorption becomes more efficient when you do eat. But the most surprising change might be how effortless it all becomes. What seemed impossible on day one feels natural by day 14. 
Your body has essentially rewired itself to work with the natural world instead of against it. The evening hours, once filled with mindless snacking and digestive chaos, become a sanctuary of cellular renewal. Deep within your abdominal cavity, fat cells that have been stubbornly holding onto their contents finally begin to release their stored energy. The process happening inside your belly is nothing short of remarkable. Your adipose tissue, particularly the visceral fat surrounding your organs, starts breaking down into free fatty acids. These molecules travel through your bloodstream like tiny fuel packets, ready to power your brain, heart, and muscles. It's a complete reversal of the storage pattern that built up over months or years of evening eating. Your pancreas, no longer forced to work overtime producing insulin for late night meals, begins to function more smoothly, supporting more stable blood sugar patterns. The constant insulin spikes that once contributed to fat accumulation gradually smooth out into a healthier rhythm. By week two, your hunger hormones undergo a noticeable change. Ghrelin, the hormone that signals hunger, learns to quiet itself as evening approaches. Meanwhile, leptin, which tells your brain when you're satisfied, becomes more effective at its job. This hormonal rebalancing means you're not fighting against your body's signals anymore. You're working with them. The belly fat that disappears during these 14 days isn't just cosmetic. Every pound lost from your midsection represents a reduction in compounds associated with inflammation. These compounds, produced by excess belly fat, can influence multiple systems in your body. As they diminish, markers throughout your system begin to normalize. Your liver deserves special recognition during this transformation. This organ, roughly the size of a football, becomes incredibly efficient at processing the fatty acids released from your belly. Instead of spending its evening hours dealing with incoming food, it focuses on breaking down stored fat and producing ketones. These ketones provide a clean, steady energy source that your brain can use effectively. The metabolic flexibility you develop is perhaps the most valuable outcome. Your body learns to seamlessly switch between burning the food you eat during the day and the fat you've stored around your midsection. This flexibility, once lost through years of constant eating, returns with surprising speed. Blood pressure may drop during this period. The reduction in belly fat means less pressure on your internal organs and blood vessels. Your heart doesn't have to work as hard to pump blood through compressed tissue. So what happens to your belly fat when you stop eating after sunset for 14 days? The answer is both simple and profound. Your body remembers how to support itself when you give it the chance. The stubborn fat that once seemed permanent begins to melt away. Not as a guarantee, but as a common outcome many people experience when aligning eating habits with natural rhythms. 14 days proves that timing isn't just everything. It's a key that can unlock your body's potential for transformation.